Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's PA Pokemon Pools back again with another Lorcana opening. Picked up at my local game store, Double Looks Games, over in uh, Elkport, Pennsylvania. Uh, they had Ursula Returns, so I grabbed a couple of things from there, along with the uh, Lumineers Quest. But today we're going to just go ahead and open up the uh, booster box, kind of see if we can get ourselves an Enchanted out of here. If not, maybe some other good pools. But they had a bunch of a bunch of stocks. So if you guys are looking for any Lorcana. It's a little bit off the beaten path, but they definitely have a whole ton of it. So we're going to go ahead and pop these open. Uh, this is the uh, newer set. Actually, they do have the plastic on them where the older boxes didn't. We were actually talking about that today. Uh, the I did pick up... What else did I get today? I picked up a box of Floodborne also. I actually didn't have a booster box of Floodborne. And I'm actually going gonna, gonna to keep that for the, for the sealed collection itself. So... But regardless, uh, let's go ahead and crack into this. There's a lot of really good enchanteds in this actual set itself. Uh, Ariel is one of them. There's a really, uh, really nice Mickey Mouse on there. A uh, little go well with my uh, my shoes that I got right there. I did uh, I did trade a couple off. I actually got rid of my Hades today for a booster box. And then uh, if you guys watched my last video, um, that's another thing I wanted to bring up. My last video, I opened up uh, booster packs into the Inklands, and I pulled a Scrooge McDuck. Um, however, the only drawback is is that Scrooge was completely damaged by um, by just the, I guess the rollers or the the what do you want to call it the the actual machines that do the printing. So I was gonna um, I did send a letter or an email letter because it's 1903. I did send an email to Ravensburger. Uh, to see what they would do about it because I know that um, Wizards of the Coast for Magic, they actually sent me a replacement card, which was actually really cool. Um, so here we're going to zoom in on this here. They sent me a replacement card to, oh, that's actually super zoom. Sorry about that. Um, to make up for like a ring card that I got when they were doing that whole Lord of the Rings thing. <clears throat> so the reasoning behind that was you know it was a really expensive card i was supposed to get it now this one just being damaged ravensburger decided that they wanted to just send me a or two packs <laughs> so so they sent me two individual packs <clears throat> oh that's kind of cool Ur ursula's garden full of the un unfortunate so I wasn't too, wasn't too thrilled about that itself, actually. So I ended up just selling off a card. There we go. There's a big hollow right out of the gate. Not bad. And then looks like we got a new puzzle piece, too. So we'll have to put that together. I'll, I'll time out the video. We'll put that together at the end of the actual video itself. Now, if I just remembered what I did with my sleeves, we'll go ahead and get that sleeved up as soon as possible. I tell you what. If my head wasn't attached, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to keep a hold of it. All right, well, we're gonna put them out to the side now. We are gonna sleeve these up though. That's um, that's definitely a really good hit right out of the gate, and it is her set naturally. So interesting. Yeah, okay, we'll look for sleeves here in a little bit. All right, so we got our little bulk pile here. So that was one pack down. Oh, they're sitting right next to me. You know what? We're gonna go ahead and sleeve that right out of the gate. Just because I don't feel safe not having a sleeve, especially if it's a, a legendary out of our first pack. Uh, this is this will probably be a um, little little mermaid heavy, honestly, to tell you the truth, because it is Ursula's return. There we go. All right, that makes me feel more comfortable, and probably you guys too. All right, back to the opening. Let's get to the fun stuff here. All right, so yeah, these packs are definitely a little bit different. Seems like they're put together a little bit, a little bit different than before. I am glad they went back to the puzzle piece, though. I think I guess in Inklands they had to do away with the actual puzzle piece because they wanted to teach everybody what the land card actually does. So let's do this. Oh, okay. So I have a feeling I think I know what the actual puzzle is going to be. I wonder if that's a nine-piece puzzle though. That seems pretty. Uh, seems pretty big. All right, there is. Oh, that's really cool. That's a nice looking stitch. We got Rhea again. Jetsum. Floatsum is probably going to be in here too, I would assume. There's old Gus. Glean. I feel like I've seen that card before. We have 
What is this? Thebus. I'm, I'm assuming that is from uh, Hercules. We got Pete back here again. Actually, Pete's last card was bad guy, and now it's a uh, rotten guy. So, <laughs> so just not good all the way around, I guess. And we got Tuck Tuck. And really nice looking bell. Yeah, that, I bet you that's a really good card. And then, oh, very nice. Yeah, we got the hollow Mickey. See, that's just a common, too. That's a really nice looking common. You know, I do like this art a little bit better than Inklands. Inklands seemed a little different, I, I guess. You know, I'm probably going to sleeve that bell, too. You know, I'm kind of short on sleeves, so we'll put it off to the side and get that one sleeved. Because I feel like some of the super rares are actually pretty legit. In this, in this pack, in this set. <clears throat> All right, so, yeah, see, this one's pressed a little bit different, too. So they did it weird. So they did it where, like, you could actually just, like, grab here and then pull. They just need to put a tear tab like they do on, uh, what's it called? Bandai cards, where you can just tear from the side. I mean, once you get good at the whole tearing from the side situation, you don't have to worry about you know, really damaging a card or anything of that nature, but... Alright, so we have... So, Ursula, that's when she went on land. Uh, Vitalisphere. We got Rose Lantern. Hidden Cove. I'll turn that one sideways so you guys can see us. So, these are all new. These all literally just came out today, so... I'm sure a lot of people haven't seen all the cards yet. So we have Olaf, so sorry about the... The slow video. Sign the scroll. We got another Ursula card. Wait, I bet you she has like 30 cards in this set. Find them and find them, I'll flatten them. We got Triton. Imperial Proclamation. And our hollow is a Peter Pan one. See, I actually I like these a little bit better. Ah, uh, we got the same puzzle piece. I'm sure we're gonna get the full puzzle if we're opening 24 packs. I'd really like to put that together but again I'm thinking it's the same picture that's actually up here on the uh, on the, the game now that they changed it up a little bit that's um used to be considered just a gift set where you would get cards and stuff with it uh, but that's a that's a game actually that you can play with uh, let's say one to two people and I guess it's probably pretty good to have something like that so I can kind of teach people how to how to actually play Lorcana. I mean, I don't know if it does or not. I know they're starting to do, they're going to start doing a, you know, Pokemon does that learn to play type thing. They're going to start doing that with this also. So, all right, we got first aid, Raya again, Pico, Gunther, Transformed Chef. What is that? I don't even know what that is. Uh, another Mickey Mouse. Looking very stoic. We have Aladdin. Khan. Great Stone Dragon. That's cool. And there's Zeus. I'm going to put the Super Rares off to the side. We got double, double Super Rares there. And we got Minnie Mouse in her Musketeer outfit. And then Daisy Duck as our Hollow. And then our other pictures. Yep, good. We don't have that one yet. I probably should have grabbed another box or pack of sleeves. I think I have one over here. I'll have to grab. I'm running low on those. All right. But really, uh, I feel like opening entire booster boxes. I haven't done it for a while. The booster boxes don't seem as, I don't know, as easy to get enchanted. I mean, it's not easy to get enchanted. Let me just put it that way. But I feel like it's a little bit more randomized if you actually uh, buy the individual packs maybe not buy them all from the same spot you know naturally but they don't have the hanger packs out because they these actually just came out i like that pluto card these actually just came out in lgs today and then i believe at the end of the month is when the uh, release is going to be for target gamestop blah, blah 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 i say gamestop but i actually i've never seen one single pack of Lorcana in a gamestop at all so chances are pretty slim. There's that Ursula's garden again. And then our hollow is pain. I'm assuming, oh, there's another puzzle piece we don't have. Yeah, like I said, once we're done here, I'll 
I'll pause the video and throw that puzzle together real quick. It looks like it might be actually like a full page nine piece situation. Uh, before it was like, I think just four itself. Okay, so actually I'll show you guys three or the, uh, the different pack arts. It looks like there's only three different pack arts again for this one here. So we have Suzu or Suzu, I don't know, uh, Ariel and then um, Ursula on here. They could probably add a little bit more pack arts, honestly. Oh. A lot of people just like to collect the, uh, boy, these, maybe I don't like the way that these open. We're going to use the, we're going to knife it from here on out. We're gonna use, yeah, we're definitely going to use the knife because that's, that is like the slowest pack opening I've ever had in my life. Okay, let's see. Let's check our puzzle piece first. Booyah! Not a one we don't have, I don't think. I don't believe so. Alright, let's see. So, hunting four wise, I, I'd like to have the aerial from this set. It's actually a really nice looking card. So I would like to get an enchanted of that. Oh, that's really cool. That's like a... <clears throat> that's like an old school type Mickey Mouse. I really like that. Not quite boxcar or, or steamboat Willie, but pretty old. Oh, there we go. There's our super rare. We got Ariel. And then Bruno's Return. Bruno, I believe, being from Emperor's New Clothes, maybe? I don't know. Not too familiar with him. But I'll take the hollow. Alright, yeah, we're going to knife this. The whole, uh... Trying to tear that thing. See, it does the same thing, too. Alright, they're doing this on purpose. They wanted to slow down openings for people. That's just what I'm guessing. <laughs> okay, puzzle piece. Again, I don't think we have that one, so... I think we're getting pretty close to having that full, full entire puzzle, so that's good. Alright, we got... Whoever that is, we have training grounds. Rose Lantern. Oh, I skipped one. Looks like we have the Fates. And then if you want to read the cards, I mean, definitely just slap a pause on that video and you can kind of zoom in and read on it. A lot of people don't need to get zoom in on YouTube. There we go. And our hello is not him. Oh, there's John Silver again. Well, he looks a little different than the last John Silver that was out. And we have whoever that is. With Donkey. I think that's the wrong. I think that's DreamWorks, not Disney. For Shrek. You know why don't they have Shrek cards? I think nobody would buy it. I don't think about it. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah, if I find another one of those Lumineer quests, um, I'll definitely open it for the for the channel just to let people see what's on the inside of there, but um, seems pretty cool. Like I said, maybe it's something me and the missus will try out. Poor unfortunate souls. I think I sing that on a regular basis. We got Pegasus, Winter Camp, Triton's Decree. Pegasus again. It's like a double Pegasus. That's an actually pretty sick looking beast card. Not hollow. There's our Hades, Prince Philip, Ursula again. And then Pegasus again. So we got the hollow Pegasus. And then, yeah, there we go. Good, we didn't have that one either. But I want to roll for the puzzle pieces. Definitely want to roll for that. All right. Eh, I'd say about a third of the way through the box here. I didn't mean to make this too long of an actual video. <coughs> but wanted to do it today. That way I can get some editing done tomorrow and then get this up for you guys so you'll probably time you see this will probably be as uh, saturday or sunday i would assume after release magic broom we got diablo he's actually one of the um one of the enchanteds aladdin we got daisy again hey that's marshmallow he was from the first set avalanche that was from the first set too I'm seeing the repeaters here. Oh, that's a really cool looking Anna card with the armor on. And we got our hollow as Casa Madrigal. 
no clue what that's from. No clue. Uh, if I were to guess, er, and Kanto? Is that Disney? I think that's Disney. Not like a Disneyologist or anything of that nature. I sell cell phones, not no Disney stuff. Except for Lorcana. You'll know a little bit about that. And I do like opening that. And I hope you guys are enjoying it too. If you guys are, go ahead and smash that like button. Get, throw a subscribe my way. We actually are over a thousand subs now. So super happy about that. Of course, I haven't done a video for a while, so what do I do? We get to a thousand subs and I just like whoop, disappear off the earth for a little bit. Oh, that's a cool roar too. I like that. Uh, I like that one. Chin Pao. I like some of the older the older art itself. It's Olaf again with a whole bunch of noses. There we go. There's a nice looking Elsa. That'll be a good card, I would assume. Treasure Untold. And then we got Tuck Tuck again, another hollow, and whoop, yep, I know we're missing that one too. Oh yeah, we'll have this puzzle put together. That would probably look pretty cool in a binder, honestly. Since, you know, most binders are nine card binders itself. Actually, you know what, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm going to grab the sleeves that I have in here before I run out. Because I feel like that's probably going to happen. for not being prepared okay all right we're safe don't worry we got it crisis averted we have sleeves coming all right i had a big package of those somewhere too i have to look for them all right what i do need is a good solution on what to do with all these empty packer uh, pack arts all right, another puzzle piece. Again, we'll put that together. All right, we got... Oh, it must be... Maybe, is this... I think this is Encanto. I'm pretty sure. Or maybe Wish... Is Wish one of them, too? I don't know. Disney just keeps shoveling out stuff. It's not like it used to be where, like, once, once every year or two, a really good Disney show came out, and that was it. Now they're just, like, throwing out as much garbage as they possibly can. Not to say it's all garbage, but most of it is. All right, we got Zeus is our super rare. And, oh, I was just complimenting that Aurora. So we got Aurora as the hollow. All right, let's grab that sleeve there. We're going to move on the old pro. Actually, I kind of like this set a little bit better than Inklands. Inklands had that, I don't know, like, what would you say, like, Indiana Jones type style to it. Never really a, a big of a fan of that. Everything was like desert and blah blah blah. All right, here we go. We got Cogsworth, Kong. Hmm. Interesting. TikTok, Gunther, Hans, and Franz. What's that? Chen Pu, Chen Pao. One of the two. Imperial Soldier. I'm thinking he's that Rayo one. Something about the dragon. Same with Li Shang. Hey, speaking of, there's Suzu. If I'm saying it wrong, probably. Sorry. Dung Hao. <clears throat> and we got the plank is our hollow. So again, puzzle piece. I angled the camera a little bit different today so you don't see a uh, full arm reaching across when I go to grab something random. I do need to get um, get adjusted a little bit. So I'm going to make more room in here. I actually bought a new shelf to set up so I'll be setting that up here pretty soon so I can put a whole bunch of stuff on it and get it up off the floor so it doesn't look like a bomb went off in here in a card shop. So we got Brawl, Tick Tock, Hidden Cove. You got to get a good look at that one there. I was thinking that's a Peter Pan situation. Don't know who Tuck Tuck is. Learning about him. Got a big old ogre. There's that big old chicken. We got Daisy again. Lee Shang again. Legacy Cannon. That's a new art. 
Ooh, Ursula, Ursula's lair. Very nice. And Jacques is our hollow. So it looks like the mice are uh, in here because we had Gus earlier from Cinderella. Cinderella. All right, looks like yeah, we're about halfway through. gonna need a bigger boat over here. All right, let's get that out. Come on, enchanted. Let's see what we can we can get, if any. So we got Augustine training ground. I don't think I showed that last time. I don't know what that's from. Honestly, possible pillar. It says Rose Lantern Fates. We got Pascal. Has a hollow for her. Let's see, Magical Maid, yep, and if they're hiring, let me know. Hey, there we go. That's a really colorful looking card. I like that, that's Flounder. We got Chai Fu, Hercules, guest on again. And then we got uh, Chain, Chain Pow for our follow again there. You could probably make this a, um, this card opening into like a drinking game like every time I say the word hollow you would uh you would you know what now that I'm looking at it I, I haven't I don't think I only got one legendary out of this so far and that was I mean it was Ursula so that was definitely definitely one of the ones to get but yeah I, don't, I think about it I mean unless I missed it uh, remind me to go through the ball after I'm done here because I feel like it'd be a bad idea not to or legendaries out there. All right, we got Augustine again. We got the plank, magic room, fates, ice block, four sphere, a couple new cards. Find them out, flatten them. We got that cool looking beast card again. We got Triton, young prince, and then Ariel. Oh, not as the hollow. It's a nice looking card though. And magic room is gonna be. Not our hollow. What am I doing? Jeez, oh man. All right, there we go. Camilla Madrigal. <laughs> I had something going on here. Actually, that magic room is a super rare. Interesting. I got pretty much all the really cool cards and then got a hollow on Camillo. Whoever the heck that is. All right, moving on. Maybe we'll start amping up. I think, from what I remember before, when I opened booster boxes in the past, we usually got three or four legendaries, honestly. Now, not necessarily hollow legendaries, but you at least got three or four legendaries. All right, I'm just throwing puzzle pieces all around. Again, like I said, we'll take that apart when we're done. All right, we got record player, if anybody knows what that is. Benja, Dolores Madrigal. Tor. What is Tor? I don't, I don't even know what Tor's from. He's a florist, wherever he's from. We have Aladdin, Triton's Titan. Dig a little deeper. And we got the Mob Song. Oh, that's when Gaston was breaking into the uh, Beast's Palace. Creaky. We got the Underworld. In fact, the Scream Hades, I don't know what does. And what is that? Nessus. Yep, not wrong for sure on who that is, but we're gonna slave it anyway. Alright, we are kind of in the home stretch here. Uh, sorta, of, maybe. Maybe not. I might be lying. I might be lying, but hey, you know what? We haven't seen these cards yet. Let's check them out. Let's absorb them. Let's bring it in. Let's see what you think about them. Right. Well, I can't wait to get my two packs from Ravensburg, though. Right, Ravensburg. These guys think that I'm gonna pull a hollow or a legendary out of the two free packs they're giving me for a damage legendary. I don't think so. Because I opened up 70 packs of Floodborne before I got one enchanted. Hey, that's new. Hidden Inkcaster. 
That's a new Anna too. Yeah, I'm definitely seeing seeing some cards that I haven't seen before. Yeah, I haven't seen that Prince Eric either. Why does Prince Eric look exactly like Aladdin? Hmm. It's almost like they're made from the same company. All right, we got the Mob Song. We got Neo Night no, 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 I don't know who that is. Uh, Peter Pan. That's going to be our super rare. And then our hollow is the forest spear again. Okay, let's pop that in there. All right, so looks like yeah, we still got a pretty good amount left here. So I lied about the time. Sit back, relax, kick your feet up, grab a drink. Watch me not pull an enchanted. You know, table and table. All right, so record player, Benja. If you see any cards that uh, are super hot that I'm missing here, toss me a chat down below, or toss me a comment down below, and we'll kind of go back through this because I do keep my bulk actually. So. Hey, nice. Rapunzel. Got her right there. On the new mat. Ursula kicking her feet back again. And Pete, the rotten guy, not the bad guy. And then our puzzle piece. That puzzle piece throws me off. I keep thinking it's, uh, if I don't take it off at first, I keep thinking that it's a enchanted party. All right. Pete is off to the side. And then, yeah, let's like about six more packs. Not too bad. Could be better. I, I mean, like I said, not really getting too many, too many legendaries. It's kind of strange. Like I said, in case I, unless I missed them, but I don't remember seeing the legendary tag, but we will go through that, this again. All right. Take that back over here. I need to buy one of those giant garbage bags. All right, there's our puzzle piece. Let's just toss that off to the side. First aid, that's Pluto hurt himself. Fazu, familiar. Adderall, not familiar. Pegasus, yep. We got Olaf, the old mouse. Vision slab, sign the scroll. Ursula, again, another sea witch. And Namari, didn't have her before. Another Flynn Rider card. Oh, 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 whoever that is. All right, some child. That's great. The child. Oh, yep, yeah, we need to break into the new sleeves after this one. All right, let's put that in there. I mean, who the heck even is that? No idea. All right, let's go with this one. I'm feeling pretty good about this one. Maybe there's something good in here. Legendary, minimum legendary, minimum. Doesn't quite smell enchanted yet. All right, puzzle piece, but bam, off to the side. And we got first aid, the zoo for sure, for show. Uh, Louisa Madrigal, we got Pegasus. This is like the same pack I just opened. Uh, oh, there's another, another Beast card. Let's see, Thick Skinned, whatever that means. We got Pain, we got Bruno's Return. Ursula's Plan, It's like a double Ursula there. Really cool looking Mickey Mouse, I think I got that hollow. See, I'm happy about that. Uh, Miracle Candle. And Make the Potion. That's actually pretty solid art for that card, honestly, to tell you the truth. So, hats off to the artist. I like that one. That is, uh, Maleficent. But, yeah, definitely really cool looking. All right, so moving on down. We got four more packs. So, again, I want to thank everybody for watching today. Even if we didn't get anything, it's still fun to open some of this stuff. Like I said, it is two-week early release before the regular stores get it. So go to your LGS, pick yourself up some boxes. Uh, my recommendation, uh, two that are in my town. There is a 
Double Lush Games has them. Oh, those are really cool, Max. I like Max. <coughs> and uh, New Dimensions actually both has boxes in. That's a new bell also. Interesting. There are probably just too many cards in each one of these sets. When you open up almost a whole entire thing and us oh, panic and uh, don't see the same card as that Mickey Mouse I liked. There's Floats of Jetsum on one. Snuggly Duckling. What is that? Let's see. Disreputable Club. Or Pub. <laughs> Drinking for children. And, oh, I jinxed myself. So we got the, uh, the hollow version of the Snuggly Duckling. <clears throat> All right, let's pop that back in there. There's a lot of stuff that I don't know, but like I said, they're kind of tending to uh, like the last like maybe like 30 years of Disney, honestly. You know, dipping back into some of the stuff with like Snow White and uh, Aurora Sleeping Beauty. All right, I keep wanting to put that off to the wrong side. So maybe I need to adjust my desk. All right, puzzle piece. All right, starting off with Eric. We got Fazu, swing into action. Dodge, tuck tuck again. Medallion weights, yeah, that's a new one. Hey, there's Flounder. What are Sebastian's in here? I haven't seen Sebastian. We got the wall. Hey, we finally got a legendary. And that is Mulan. I'll take it. And then Anna is our hollow. So Braving the Storm. I feel like that's probably a pretty good hollow to have. And we're going to sleeve up Mulan also. Since it is our second legendary, I believe. It's kind of weak for a box, honestly, to tell you the truth. I'm going to put that with my hollows. All right, two more, two more, two more shots. Unless I was gonna open more. I do have a handful of first chapters sitting there, but I kinda wanna hold off on that for right now, to be honest. All right, there's our Flotsam or Jetsam, one of the two. There's Max again. We got Mulan again. Mandragol, make the potion. The winter camp. Hmm. What does that say? A medical tent. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, another Ariel. Determined mermaid. Mulan. Triton again when he was younger. Mulan again. Mystical Rose. Oh, there we go. We got Diablo. I think I just willed those into existence. And then, ah, that's a cool hollow to have that stitch. So, yep. Another double, double sleeve pack there. I'm all right with that. And then we're coming down to our last pack magic. So again, I want to thank everybody for watching today. A little bit of a longer video, but I wanted to kind of just look at the art, you know, kind of check out the, the new Lorcana cards itself. Oh, there we go for Ursula's return. So I hope everybody enjoyed it. And other than that, we should be good. So let's see if we get ourselves a little LPM. And then I'll do a little, I'll do some pause action, do a little clean up throughout that puzzle piece here for you guys. Go so check that out. But like I said, it's going to be the same picture as what's up on the, uh, on the Lumineers quest. Okay, so last puzzle piece. I better, I better have all those puzzle pieces. I'll tell you that right now. All right. We got Cogsworth, Li Shang, Magic Broom, Hidden Inkcaster, Hans Franz. Mickey Mouse again. Vision Slab. Prince Eric. Floatsome. Uh, Madrigal. And our last hollow is Hera. Oh, oh, actually, you know what? No, that's not our hollow. What are you thinking? Paper one pools. Boom, there's our hollow. Ah, there you go. Nice. Oh, that's a really good hollow. Even better than uh, Hera, honestly. So. But yeah, other than that, guys, this is PA Pokemon Pools. I want to thank everybody for watching. Uh, hang on just for a couple seconds here, and I'll go ahead and put that puzzle together, and we'll throw it up on the screen here. All right, guys, and we're back. So I put it together. I actually almost thought we didn't. We were just going to be missing one actual piece, but yeah, it's pretty cool. So that'll be like for your nine-page binder. It'll be 
literally that same picture right there when you put it together. So, other than that, this being Pokemon Pools. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good evening.